In this tutorial, we're just going to look at some basics of HTML or hypertext markup language and just some setup uh, we're going to do for the, pre uh, for the future tutorials. So, basically what we're going to be using is a web browser. Uh, you should almost certainly have one of those. Uh, I'm using Mozilla Firefox, but you can use uh, Internet Explorer or uh, Google Chrome. Those are fine. Uh, and I'm also using a web editor. If you don't have a web editor, that's going to be something such as uh, Dreamweaver. Maybe you have that or uh, or something similar. But I'm using Bluefish Web Editor, which is going to be a uh, free open source uh, web editing program uh, that you can download off the internet. Just go to Google, type in Bluefish Web Editor. The uh, homepage is Bluefish bluefish.openoffice.nl bluefish.openoffice.nl so uh, go ahead and go to the download page there and uh, basically uh, you can just download the program off of there so uh, I won't show you how to do that because my page isn't loading that fast. But uh, anyway, we're just going to open. Uh, we're just going to open Bluefish, and this is just kind of the stuff we uh, can do with it. We're gonna uh, we're gonna start something new here, and I'm just going to show you a little bit about HTML tags. Okay, so we're gonna. Uh, we're going to be doing uh, just just some basic tags just to show you how they work. Now. A tag goes like this. Okay, we're gonna have one of these little brackets here. All right. Hopefully you can see that, and we're gonna end it with one of these little brackets here. Right. What goes in between here makes up the tag. So say uh, say we wanted to have a tag called well, we'll just say um, B for bold. Okay. And now over here we want to have a, another tag to end the boldness, I guess. Uh, but we want to we want to put a slash right there, right? Okay. Now this slash means end, so this tag means start bold, okay? And this tag means end bold, okay? End bold, bold, end bold, okay? So anything in between here is going to be bold right so that'll be bold text so that's basically how HTML uh, that's basically how HTML tags work okay we have a start tag and an end tag now here if I add another one we're just gonna say I and I for italic and italic right italic so we're gonna have uh, bold here okay bold and bold uh, start bold end bold anything between start of start bold and end bold is bold right now here we have start italic and end italic anything in between start italic and end italic is italic this is just how you code in html so that's just the basic explanation of tags okay um, if you're not following that well, that's okay. I think you'll pick it up, uh, pick it up from uh, later video tutorials. But at any rate, we're going to be using Bluefish Editor. And uh, if you want to play around with the buttons on Bluefish, uh, you can kind of get comfortable with it and uh, start learning how it works. Um, let me... Yeah, so uh, basically, basically all I want you to do is let's let's go into uh, how to install bluefish right um, because it's not it's not instantly clear off of the website but i believe what you would i believe what you would want to do is probably go probably go to sourceforge.net and is this an exe file yeah, right there. Yeah, just just go to these uh, the sourceforge.net file, right, and then you you're gonna end up right there. And you can download the latest version, Bluefish uh, 2.0.3 setup.exe or whatever it's gonna be when you get there. And uh, you can just download it through that link. So 
hopefully that'll be easy enough for you and I'm uh, looking forward to uh, working with you in future tutorials. Alright, thank you.